Hey, what's up you guys? My name is Megan Prosser and today we're not making a video about snakes and bearded dragons and reptiles and whatnot. Although I do have a corn snake video up, you should definitely go check that out. But no, it's not going to be about reptiles. It's not going to be about my hair even. It's going to be a new topic. <gasps> so, a little fun fact about me, although it's not a fun fact at all. It's probably the worst fact about me is that I am prone to the um, infection of the uh, urinary tract. So yes, for the past four years, since I was 16, I'm 20 now, I have been having chronic UTI. Some are super severe and I feel like I am just like dying. And then others are just like pain and they'll go away in a few days and I'm just kind of like, okay, bye. These seven tricks are pretty great. So I'm gonna share them with you guys in case you're like me and you just don't wanna go see a doctor. So tip number one, and honestly, this is my favorite tip. You take a bath and you get a fourth cup of baking soda, literally baking soda, like the Arm & Hammer baking soda. You put it in your bath, you mix it around, you make it all nice, it doesn't feel like anything different, but for whatever reason, it stops the burning in your yuha. Tip number two is cliche, but it really does help drink so much water, literally drink so much water. So when you have a UTI, you feel like you have to pee constantly. And when you don't actually have to pee and you go to pee and it's just like a drop comes out, it's literally like Satan has just gone up there and just punched you. Feels like you're peeing knives or fire or anything bad to pee out. That's what it feels like is happening. So make yourself have to pee so you can avoid that death pee. Literally always have a water bottle on you and just drink it up and then it shouldn't hurt as bad when you pee because it'll actually have stuff to pee out plus it'll help you flush out the infection so drinking water is key tip number three is literally sit in the bathroom for like three hours i swear to god i don't know why it helps when i have uti when they're really bad the only thing that makes me feel better is sitting on the toilet Literally the only thing that makes me feel better is sitting on the toilet or gross, I know, but it's my bathroom so I don't really care, is laying on the bathroom floor. I don't know what it is, being close to the bathroom, the toilet is just so comforting and it honestly helps after a while of like sitting and just like reflecting and being like, okay, my life is gonna, it's gonna be okay. Then eventually you'll be able to stand up and go walk around, but it might take a while, but that's in extreme cases, is to just sit on the toilet and just like let your body do its thing. Tip number four is to distract yourself, because when you have a UTI, literally the only thing you can think about is the pain going on down there. And it's really hard to not think about the pain when it's just constant like, You know, it's really hard to ignore that one that's going on down there, so. But yes, try to distract yourself. Hang out with your friends. I know sometimes that's like not, you can't do that because if you have a really severe UTI and you're like throwing up and stuff, then that can't happen. But if you're just like having some trouble peeing, just slight discomfort, you know, hang out with friends, hang out with your family, watch a movie, play some games. I don't know, distract yourself. One time I had a really bad UTI at Six Flags. It was really bad. And it was so weird, my friend actually also had a UTI with me. Like we both got it on the way to Six Flags and it was so weird. Besides that, it helped me so much being at Six Flags because all I wanted was to curl up in a ball on my bed and cry. But since I was at Six Flags, I obviously had to like ride rides. And every single time I went on a ride, completely forgot that I even had like pain going on down there. So basically what I'm trying to say is go to Six Flags if you have a UTI. No, but actually just distract yourself. It will help because you won't be thinking about the <laughs> going on. Tip number five is to not drink like sugary things. I don't know why, but like if I have a UTI and I'm drinking like orange juice or like apple juice or like basically anything that's not water, I don't know why my pee, well actually I do know why because it's freaking sugar that makes your pee acid. That will hurt so bad to pee out. So literally keep yourself to just water. So don't drink too many sugary things because it's gross. I don't even know if there's science behind that, but I swear it hurts me so bad. So this is my knowledge passing on to you. Don't drink the sugary stuff. Tip number six is to go out and get some medicine. So I swear by this. This is literally the best thing that anybody has ever created in the whole entire world is 
Azo. Azo maximum strength. Azo normal strength is like whatever. Maximum strength is the way to freaking go. So basically it just helps relieve the pain of a UTI. It doesn't really fight the infection at all. So that's the part that sucks, but at least it lets you like go out and do things. Like literally if I'm out and about and I feel a UTI coming on and I'm like, oh God, I gotta go home. All I do is pop some azo and then it's literally like 20 minutes later, all good. I can go walk around, I can run a marathon, I can work out, I can go hang out with friends, I can do whatever. So that is called Azo. And again, I'll put the picture right here. But Azo, Azo medicine is the best ever. And then the last and final tip is to actually go see a doctor because they will resolve it much quicker than just these little tips. Sometimes you just need like a day or two, but then when it like gets to like a week, it's like exhausting. So just go see a doctor, they'll give you antibiotics and then like you won't have a UTI in like a day, it goes away. <laughs> so tip number seven is to literally just go to the doctor and get yourself figured out. So that's it for my tips and tricks on how to help you ease the pain of a UTI. If you guys liked this video, please click the thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time, maybe for another UTI video. Ooh. Or probably a trick video. So see you guys next time, bye.